Hey, honey. Get that sumo, cause I did that. I was like, oh my gosh, you call me baby. <laughs> and here he goes. Hey, Y'all doing too much. Hold up. Oh, I'm in the wrong lane. Oh, oh, child, I gotta get back over. Getting out of Virginia, heading to North Carolina. First best thing right here, riding on tubes. Oh, let's do it. Hey, we are on the way out of Virginia, on the way back down south. I 95, I 64 right now, but eventually I'll get on I 95 and I 95 all the way to Miami. But we do have one more stop, one more overnight stop. Today's Friday, May 3rd, 2024. Right now I'm headed to Myrtle Beach, South Kakilaki to go see my sister, my little sister who's in college, rising senior at Coastal Carolina. <sighs> And also to pick up my house keys because I left my house keys in South Carolina. <laughs> Silly me, right? I always got to leave a little something behind. Ain't no telling what I just left at my mom's house. But I know that it will be there when I get back or she can ship it to me. Ooh, big truck. So he need to get over. Get on over, baby. All right, 30 miles on I-64 West. I'm about to go see my future ex-husband. I used to love this man, but not anymore. I still like his music. I met him in person. I brought his bottle of alcohol when he was selling alcohol. But you know, honestly, when artists have children and they're like not in a committed relationship, but even when they are in a committed relationship or like marriage or something, what I'm trying to say is when artists become baby daddies, I don't like them no more. <laughs> <laughs> and I know it's a little shallow, but I don't like baby daddies in real life. Um, I'm not marrying a baby daddy because I ain't no baby mama. So that kind of turned me off by this artist that I'm going to go take a picture with. And that's okay because he still makes good music and that ain't got nothing to do with me. Ooh, child, why my stomach low-key hurting, but I'm gonna let it go. I'm not gonna think about it too much. Ooh, child, ooh, ooh. What is they doing? Calm down, baby. That's scary. Jesus, ain't that deep? Still can't get nowhere. Ooh, last thing I wanna see is an accident. The last, last thing I wanna be is in an accident. So, we chillin'. Vibe and talking. I do want to get into some things, but right now I really want to listen to some music, get into this ride, and relax. So I'll holler at y'all later. Okay, had to reset the mic. I don't know why stuff don't want to work when I need it to work, but taking my first exit, getting out of Virginia, heading to North Carolina. I got a few stops in North Carolina. Uh oh, where well, I'm going? Okay, to the left, to the left towards Rocky Mountain but I wanted to get into these nails child get into them okay because I did that paint job by me hold up oh I'm in the wrong lane all right there we go oh oh child I gotta get back over oh I'll talk about the nails in a minute hold on let me get through let me get through yes heading to South Carolina from Virginia I'm gonna break my ride up in Myrtle Beach South Carolina stay overnight with my little sister I'm going back to college, y'all. Going back to college. I'm so excited. Ooh, come on, bro. I am going back to college. Leaving home, leaving my mama house, and going back to college. I have a great story behind this college and my sister. I'll tell y'all real, real soon. I choose a fine time to get on the microphone. Going around curves. You know you need all your concentration when you riding. Okay, I'm in sixth gear. 295 South. Yes, get into this paint job, y'all. I did my nails. I only had to repaint one finger so far. I need to repaint this one. So I had to turn back around, right? And I messed up my nail before I took off. And I was like, oh, forget it. You know, it's going to happen. Then I had to turn back around. So my mom, she brought the nail polish back down to me so I could fix the nail. This one right here. And I had already asked her. I was like, you want that polish? She was like, yeah. I was like, okay, whatever. So anyways, I turned back around. She go in the house, get the passport, then bring back the polish too. And she was like, go ahead, fix your nail. So I fixed it. And I get her back the polish. And then she said, huh, take it. She let me have the polish, y'all. My mama don't like to let nothing go. And then purple is her favorite color. And this purple looks real good on my hand. But as you can see, I paint my own nails. 
my mom she goes to the salon to get her nails done now i've been itching to get my nails painted but i saw my big sister this weekend in south carolina and i was like oh your nails pretty how much she said 65 i said oh child them nails gotta stay at the nail shop because 65 is a lot of money y'all especially right now and she said ain't 65 because mine's long i'm like still that's just too much money you spent enough money for the both of us so she said 65 i'm thinking that's three tanks of gas three and a half tanks of gas i can't get that to the nail shop i've been stopped going to the nail shop because they can be a little prejudiced and they can't now let me rephrase that they are prejudiced i've seen it i experienced it i done had to help another girl out with painting her nails i done had to help people communicate in the nail shop you know they need our black hands to do our nails so they can put money in their pocket and we want our nails done but you ain't gonna treat me like shit and you're holding my hand so you know my my dollar is very protected i don't play about my coin at all you gonna be prejudiced i don't care if you black white orange green indian them brown folks they something else too but anyways i ain't talking about that i'm talking about my nails so my sister sold me 65 dollars i was like nah let me go on, paint up my nails so i paint them this morning and then my mom gave me the bottle of polish so i'm just admiring them so hard oh my bad dude i ain't even see them i like the way it's uh, every biker y'all i always say everybody whether they waving at me or not yeah painting my nails and i got the whole bottle so if i mess up i can fix it so i'm super excited about that I got 15 miles to my exit see he ain't say hey see i got my little two fingers out here for nothing <laughs> but i ain't pressed y'all i love everybody Whew, hold up. I feel like I gotta sneeze when it won't come out. So, child, I forgot everything. I'm so focused on the sneeze. I'm like, are you gonna come out? Because if you go come out, I'm gonna lift up my helmet. <laughs> I think it, it has subsided. But now it's done. 22 minutes from my first stop. I'm about to go see my husband. Future ex-husband. Or should it be ex-future husband? Yes, ex-future husband. I thought this was going to be my husband and my dreams one day, but I don't even want them no more. Almost there, 22 minutes, and this stop is still in Virginia. I'm going to St. Petersburg, Virginia. And then my second stop, I will officially be in North Carolina. I'm doing the Just GQ Mural Hunt Challenge. 25 murals. I think I counted last night. I have about 22, so all these ones I'm getting now are just extra. At this point, I'm going with the best picture that I take. That's how I'm going to submit my 25. Florida, I have none in Georgia, but I, I plan to research. But honestly, if I have enough of mural pics, I'm not going to stop in Georgia. But I do want to go to Savannah. I'm trying to find a reason to stop in Georgia, even though I don't really care about Georgia. So Florida, South Carolina, Virginia, D.C., Maryland. I already got five states. North Carolina, six. So when he announced that mural challenge, it was just perfect timing for... It was in perfect alignment of this trip that I had planned since early this year. Now, I'm really supposed to be in Africa, but hey, this is the first best thing right here, right on two. I'll get back to Africa real soon. It's a little warm out here, but I'm going to keep my jacket on because them bugs come like rocks and I don't want a bugged out shirt. I need to clean my windshield as is. I'm doing the most. I'm acting like I got tips on my fingers. You know how when you first get your nose done, you be tapping on everything? I can't stand the girls that do that. My mama do that. My work friend does that. I be like, y'all doing too much. We know you got some tips on your nails, but I'm doing the same thing because I got this fresh paint job and I can't stop admiring my nails. I'm going to fix this one next stop. It's perfect to paint your nails and get right on your bike. I think I'm going to start going live and having biker girl talk just with myself and whoever joins the live and just talk about some topics I always think about or journal about or just want to talk about get off my chest type of setup. And also I'll paint my nails because I try to make painting my nails once a week 
a self-care activity but sometimes I never get to it but you know you have to make time for anything that you want I need a good hour to let me tell you how I gotta paint my nails I gotta I already have used the bathroom I have to be fully dressed I have to have my shoes on I have to have the dishes washed before I do my nails because silly on me I love to do my nails and have 10,000 things to do that will mess up my fresh paint job. Like today, I painted my nails while I was waiting on a video to download. I left dishes in the sink, so I couldn't do the dishes. And I told my mom, sorry, I can't do the dishes. I just painted my nails and she didn't trip. And it wasn't a lot anyways. And plus I've been washing dishes, cooking and cleaning all weekend, all week since I've been where. But it's like, I always do my nails at the most silliest times. And I swear it's not intentional. It's like, I'll do my nails and I know I'm rushing out the door and I know I don't have my shoes on. And I'll try my hardest not to mess them up. But guess what? Yeah, gonna mess them up. I always, I always have to repaint at least three times. But today I only did, I did a base coat and then I did one layer of paint and then I did a top coat because if you do two layers, which is what I like to do, what you should do, but it takes longer to dry. And I knew I was about to hit the road. So I only did one layer and it looks good and it's, it's dry perfectly. Like I can do all this. And then I messed this one up because my mom said, oh, what's in your back pocket? Silly me, I reach in my back pocket and I scrape my nail and that's how I got it messed up. But now we are fixed and it should be dry. Let me see, yep, nice and dry. It's a little, see that's how I messed it up. So it's a little dented, but we got full paint. Ah, 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 6.5 miles. Oh, did I mention that I am five hours behind schedule? Oh my gosh, I could be in Myrtle Beach right now. My plan was to leave at 7 a.m. I don't know why I was lying to myself, but I left at 12 p.m. And I left late because I was editing a video for Chibu Chi HHG YouTube channel, which I dropped on YouTube an hour ago. Go check it out. I'll leave the link right up here. So I was finishing up the video. When you think, oh, I only got a little bit left, that little bit is a lot of it. And you got to keep running through the material, keep running through it. Oh, should I tweak that should i take that out should i add a transition it's it's a lot of tweaking it's a lot of attention to detail so it's never you can never really rush through it so i woke up at 3 30 a.m then i took like an hour break i shouldn't have took that hour break but all is well because i'm on my own time and i'm good i'm good to go i'm out here now and that's all that matters i just want safe travels and like the gospel song says He's an on time God. Oh, yes, he is. Mm, mm, mm. On time God. Yes, he is. He may not be on honor, but he'll be right on time. Something like that. I played that this morning as I was showering and I played my song, Smokey Norfolk. I need you now. I know I can't say. But I'm gonna sing anyway. I need you now. I need you right now, right now. Mm. That song do something to my spirit. All the gospel songs. I'm about to listen to some gospel in a minute. Okay, yeah, let me do that. I'm gonna listen to some gospel and I'll be back when I pull up to my ex future husband. Bye. Fear of doing things on my own. Ooh, I wasn't expecting to have to go four miles within the city, child. But it's all good, because it's worth it, because it's my future ex-husband in my dreams. Okay, back to my gospel. What can I do? Gotta stay true. Baby girl, you are a star, and I can't help but wait. Okay, we pulling up to my future ex-husband. Oh my gosh, there he go. It is still here. That's lit. Ooh. Ooh. It's still here. Ah. Honey, I'm home. Oh, I'm sorry. Go ahead, big truck. Because I'm actually trying to get by. Ooh, I like that purple. <laughs> 
You already know I'm trying to see my husband. Hey, boo. What's good? Yes. That might be Trey Songz in the purple truck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, child. Hey, boo. Mwah. I miss you. That had a baby on me. Anyways, let's get the pig. That's what we came for. Ooh, actually, whatever. You know, I like the pipe side of the show. Okay, y'all. I'm at my ex future husband. Y'all, check him out. Hey, ex future husband. Trey songs back home. Okay, let's get into the artist. Period. Look at him driving the convertible. So Trey songs is from St. Petersburg, VA. And this is why he is here on this wall. I like it. It does look like him. Hey fam. He might be Trey Uncle. <laughs> I'm cracking myself. Oh, let me stop. Okay, let's take the picture. Hey, boo. Period. Hey, I'm away. Um, oh, oh, hey. Can't help away. Yay, yay. Hey, honey. Y'all, this is my man, Trey Songz. Trey Songz is my future. Mm -mm. My ex, future husband in my dreams. I used to love Trey Songz. I met him in New Orleans. I had brought his liquor when he was selling liquor and he autographed it. And my thumb had got into the Sharpie. He was like, oh, watch your finger, baby. I was like, oh my gosh, he called me baby. <laughs> and here he goes. Again, we out here in St. Petersburg, Virginia, because this is where Trey Songz Trey Songz is from. On two wheels, getting up out of here, going back down south to the MIA. But first, we got a few stops. I love it. Everybody's so friendly in St. Petersburg. Everybody just a waving and hey, how you doing? Whew. It's hot, y'all. Let me get going. I gotta stay in the wind because it's too hot. And I gotta pee and I gotta get to Myrtle Beach. And your girl already five hours behind schedule, but it's okay because we outside. Can't help but wait. So St. Petersburg is really cute, really southern. And I really gotta pee and the speed limit is like 25 miles per hour right here and I'm doing 30 and I can't go no slower than that. Okay, they got the fish fry outside. It is Friday night. I mean Friday afternoon. I'm not hungry though, but I too gotta pee. Ooh, 7 Eleven or Wawa, 7 Eleven or Wawa. Cause I kinda wanna slurpee. Shout out to Trey Songs though. I love Trey Songs. I used to be in love with Trey Songs. Now, he cool. He tight. He tight. Type shit. I think I'm gonna go to 7 Eleven. Even though I should go to Wild Wild because I feel like they got a better bathroom, but child, it don't even matter at this point. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Let me give you one of my stickers. I'm Hansa Harley girl. I'm, I'm originally from South Carolina, but I'm from, I live in Florida. Let's see, let's see. This way you can always remember me. Ah, say that again. No, my mom lives in Williamsburg. Oh, okay then. Yep, yeah, and um, here's my sticker too. They're stickers, so okay. stick okay. them somewhere. I'll, I'll stick them somewhere, baby. Yes, sir. Take care now. Take Thank care you. Now. Yes, sir. Thank you. Oh, child. He want to flirt. I saw him too. Oh, child. Ooh. I think I done tinkle on myself. Trey Songs, all this for you. All right. I am done with petersburg virginia i kept saying saint petersburg but that's in florida i'm in petersburg virginia about to head on down north kakilaki get to the carolinas let's go let's ride and you know i'm bumping that trey songs throughout the city going 25 miles per hour so everybody see me no really because that's the speed limit and i'm trying to stay ticket free on this journey so it's best we do the speed limit oh, i'm about to hit that i 95 90 
five hey i have a couple stops in north carolina because i have no murals from north carolina but i have some mapped out then i'll be smooth selling all the way to south khaki lackey myrtle beach conway to be exact because i'm going back to college man college was the good days i hope you were able to go to college and not even for the degree but for the experience you only get to do that once in a lifetime at that nice beautiful age and i definitely did it and my sister is doing it right now i'm so proud of her well my sister I'll tell that story once I get rolling. I may have to tell it again and again and again. Because I'm really proud of her. Let's hear a little music while we wait at the red light. The way that you move. Next song, Trey. Yes. So out to the beautiful girls. Which one of y'all? Which, which one of y'all? Let's do it at 95 South, all the way to the 305. But we got like seven stops in between. Enjoy the ride, y'all. Y'all make sure y'all like my video. Leave me a comment. Let me know what's goody. And subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And most importantly, enjoy the ride. If you got tools, it's riding season, baby. Let's ride. Let's ride, hey, let's ride, hey, let's ride, hey. Clean on the inside, clean on the outside, clean on the inside, clean on the outside. And that's where we at, outside. Ooh, I'm talkative. When Molly Cyrus said, I can talk to myself for hours. Molly was saying about me, child, because I can talk to myself for hours. Shout out to Molly Cyrus. She's a Sagittarius too. The best sign on the planet. Fifth gear. Let's get into six. And we in six. Let's ride. Enjoy the ride.